Oftentimes, when I'm explaining to the patients in my office uh, the benefits of grounding or earthing, they understand the concept of uh, earthing and grounding yourself to the earth and the benefits that provides. But a lot of times they don't understand how by plugging this little thing into the grounding part of your outlet, how that in, can equate to or how that's the same as if you're walking barefoot on the beach or barefoot in the grass. So today I'm going to kind of explain that to you um, in showing you the actual components. It's a lot easier to understand when you visually can see uh, things than just having it explained to you a lot of times, or at least I'm, I'm that way. I understand and I learn better when I can visually see something. So. Let's start at when your house is being built, uh, the electrician is going to ground your electrical system. And how they do that is there's usually a copper rod or a rod like this. It's eight or nine feet long. You can see, can't get it all in the video there, but you can see how long that is. What they will do is they will take and drive this into the ground, into the earth, and out by your electrical uh, outside, uh, disconnect and meter and that provides a connection so to speak to the earth or to the ground so if there's any type of uh, electrical um, thing it helps to ground that uh, and helps to prevent shock those types of things uh, you need to talk to an electrician they can explain that in more detail so anyway so what they'll do is they'll ground they'll drive this into the ground and then they take um, a piece of wire it's usually green, green is for ground, and then they'll connect this. They'll strip this end off of here. They connect that with this connector here. They put that through there, and then they tighten that down. So it's a nice, secure connection. So then this green wire, this grounding wire, goes to your main panel in your house. That's where all your uh, breakers are. It's called a breaker box. Well. Each one of those are, are uh, grounded. And then that also grounds through, again, another green wire that goes to each of your outlet boxes, which have an outlet in it. And we all are familiar with this, okay? This is what you'll be plugging your grounding mat or grounding sheet into. And this goes right in this part here. Now, that part is connected to this little green screw on the outlet, okay? And that little green screw is also connected to this green wire, okay? And remember where this green wire goes. It goes all the way back out to the ground through this grounding rod, and that's how you get the connection to the earth, okay? For those of you that aren't sure if your outlets are grounded correctly, there's a little tester and you'll want to make sure that you get one of those and make sure that you are properly grounded in the outlet. Otherwise, you will not get the benefits of the grounding. So we plug this in. We know our outlet is grounded properly. We plug that in. And then this little snap, as we showed you earlier on another video, snaps into the sheet uh, that goes over your bed. And then when that does, you have that on there, your bare skin touches that, and then that gives you the same as effects as if you're walking barefooted or laying on the ground or in the, on the beach, in the uh, water, or the ocean, uh, lakes, those types of things. So hopefully that explains things. Now, I do want to mention one other thing. Say that you find out that you have an older house, historic house, or for some reason, whatever, uh, outlet you're wanting to plug into is not grounded properly, they do make an extension. So this extension would go onto this cord that plugs into your outlet normally, and then what you would do, instead of going into an outlet, this 40-foot wire, then you would have to figure out a way to get this either uh, out the corner of the window or make a hole in through the floor and out the side of the how somehow you could get a contractor to be able to get this to the outside. And then when you get this to the outside, you put this grounding rod into the ground. Again, it's connecting the sheet to the earth. 
So then anytime your bare skin touches that, you're getting the benefits of being grounded or earthing. So hopefully that helps explain things um, in a little more detail. You get a little better understanding of how actually when you do plug that into a grounded outlet and then lay on the grounding sheet that you're getting the benefits of grounding. So stay tuned for the next uh, video and we'll explain a little more detail as far as some of the studies and the really interesting and uh, exciting information that is coming out of uh, some of the research.